What if I told you that by the end of this decade a single Bitcoin could be worth over $1 million? Surprising, isn't it? The mere thought of it makes you sit up and take notice, makes you wonder if it's just a fairy tale. The number, 1 million is such a grand figure it's hard for us to wrap our minds around it. But hold on, this statement isn't some far-fetched idea drawn from a children's book of tales. This isn't a prediction made by a random street fortune teller, a prophecy from an ancient scroll found in some forgotten corner of the world. It's not a hypothetical guess, nor a statement made in jest. It's not a baseless assumption or a prediction based on whims and fancies. It's not the result of a dream or a vision, nor is it made on a whim. It's not even a prediction made after interpreting the alignment of the stars or the mystic tarot cards. This is a forecast. A forecast that comes from a highly reputable source, an individual whose financial acumen is recognized and respected globally. This projection comes from none other than Kathy Wood, the visionary who is the founder, CEO, and chief investment officer of ARK Invest. She is not just anyone. She's Bloomberg News' best stock picker of 2020, a woman of substance, whose predictions and decisions have a significant impact on the world of finance. She is the one who dared to make this audacious prediction. In conclusion, this isn't a prophecy from a fortune cookie. It's a forecast from Kathy Wood, the founder, CEO, and chief investment officer of ARK Invest and Bloomberg News' best stock picker of 2020. So, what is the basis of Kathy's bold prediction? It's an intriguing question that invites us to delve deeper into the financial world, specifically focusing on the roller coaster ride of global policies. To truly understand this prediction, one must grasp the nature of the dramatic changes happening in the world economy. Governments across the globe are behaving in an unprecedented manner. They're not just printing money, they're doing so at an incredible pace, a rate unseen in history. This phenomenon isn't confined to one or two, it's a global trend, happening from the towering skyscrapers of New York to the bustling markets of Shanghai. The outcome? A drastic reduction in the value of money, the thing we work hard to earn and save. The currency that we hold dear is losing its worth every day, a phenomenon known as devaluation. But that's not all. There's another consequence, inflation. Prices of goods and services are soaring, making everyday living more expensive and savings less valuable. In this economic chaos, one entity stands out with its stability and finite nature, Bitcoin. Just like the precious metal gold served as a stable store of value in times of economic turmoil in historical times, Bitcoin with its limited supply is seen as a digitized version of the same, a safe haven during financial storms. In such a scenario, Bitcoin with its limited supply emerges as a store of value, much like gold in the past. Kathy Wood's prediction also leans heavily on the significance of the newly approved Bitcoin ETFs. These exchange-traded funds, or ETFs, are a major development in the world of cryptocurrency. They carry with them an unprecedented amount of weight and importance, acting as a veritable seal of verification and acceptance from the United States government, authority in the global financial landscape. These Bitcoin ETFs, which have been a much-anticipated arrival, have effectively opened up the floodgates, permitting the seamless flow of enormous amounts of institutional capital into the previously somewhat elusive realm of Bitcoin. This is no ordinary shift in the financial tides we're observing here. Rather, it's transformative wave of change that has the potential to leave an indelible mark on the landscape of cryptocurrency investment. When we speak of trillions of dollars, it's not merely a whimsical figure plucked from thin air, but an actual tangible reality that forms the backbone of this globally significant transition. This isn't a trickle of funds we're discussing, this is a torrent of capital, a veritable deluge of financial investment that is poised to flood the Bitcoin sheer volume of this capital influx is staggering. It's an influx that could potentially underpin, secure and indeed fortify the Bitcoin ecosystem to a degree that hasn't been witnessed before. This isn't small change we're talking about. It's an influx of capital that has the potential to fortify the Bitcoin ecosystem significantly. But it's not just the quantity of this capital that's important. Indeed, the amount of capital invested can be a valuable indicator of interest and commitment. Yet there's another factor to consider that is equally if not more crucial. It's about the quality of the capital, the very nature of the investors who believe in Bitcoin's potential and the type of investors we see pouring into Bitcoin can dramatically shape its trajectory. Short-term speculators, the ones that are merely in it for a win, can cause unsettling price fluctuations with their buy and sell whims, 
they tend to invest high amounts and exit the market as soon as they see a dip, causing sudden and drastic price drops which instill fear, uncertainty, and doubt in other investors. However, most of this capital will likely be from long-term holders, those who have an unwavering belief in the technology and the transformational possibilities it presents. These long-term holders are not deterred by temporary market dips or sways, they recognize the inherent value of not just as a speculative asset, but as a revolutionizing force in the financial world. They invest not just with the intention of making profits but also with a vision of supporting a system that challenges and changes the traditional financial norms. The presence of these long-term holders what fosters a more resilient and robust Bitcoin ecosystem. It becomes a powerful force against wild price swings, creating a sense of stability that can invite even more investors and create a strong foundation for Bitcoin's value. This means a more stable and robust Bitcoin ecosystem, less susceptible to the wild price swings we've seen in the past. Now let's circle back to Kathy Wood's prediction. A $1 million Bitcoin by 2030. An audacious claim indeed and one that has stirred up a whirlwind of speculation and debate in both the cryptocurrency community and the financial world at large. It's a prediction that, if it comes to fruition, would catapult Bitcoin into an entirely different stratosphere of value relevance. Imagine for a moment, a single unit of a digital decentralized currency being worth a staggering $1 million. The implications of such a scenario are far-reaching and potentially revolutionary. It's not just about the astronomical price tag, it's about what such an unprecedented valuation would symbolically represent. This would infuse Bitcoin with an unparalleled degree of legitimacy, credibility, and societal relevance. It would mark a definitive turning point, a moment where Bitcoin transitions from being viewed as a speculative digital asset to a genuine, universally acknowledged store of broader implications of such a development would extend beyond the realm of finance and into society at large. It would signal a radical departure from traditional fiat currencies and an embrace of a new, digital mode of commerce. It would represent a paradigm shift in the way we perceive money and value. A million-dollar Bitcoin would not just be an asset of immense financial worth, but a symbol of a new era of digital currency. It's not just about the price tag, it's about what such a valuation would mean for the global financial system. It would represent a paradigm shift in the way we perceive money and value. But predictions, as we all know, are not certainties. They are based on a myriad of factors, current trends being one of them. The other elements include assumptions which are derived from empirical evidence, statistical analysis, and expert opinions. The dynamic nature of these factors makes predictions fascinating yet uncertain. It's like trying to capture a flowing river in a snapshot. The river continues to change even after the picture is taken. This idea of ever-changing reality applies to every field of human endeavor. Be it economics, sports, politics, or technology, we're always trying to anticipate the future. Predictions become our guiding light, a beacon of sorts that provides us with a semblance of direction amidst the chaos of uncertainty. However, it's important to understand that these predictions are not ironclad truths. They are estimates, educated guesses that can help us make informed decisions. Sometimes they come true, sometimes they don't. But they always provide us with a framework with which we can see the future. When it comes to Kathy Wood's analysis, it is a perfect example of this prediction conundrum. The reasoning behind her prediction is based on years of experience, diligent research, and a deep understanding of the market dynamics. Her insights offer a map of possible future scenarios, each one a distinct possibility. Her predictions, like any other, carry a degree of uncertainty, but they are not mere speculations. Kathy Wood's analyses are meticulously crafted, backed by solid data and a deep understanding of the factors at play. As such, they provide some compelling food for thought. While Kathy Wood's prediction has stirred up a considerable buzz in the financial world, it's important to note that not everyone shares her optimistic outlook. Kevin O'Leary, a well-known investor and television personality, presents a contrasting viewpoint. O'Leary, also known as Mr. Wonderful from the hit TV show Shark Tank, has expressed his skepticism about the idea of Bitcoin hitting the $1 million mark. Although he acknowledges the potential of Bitcoin as a digital asset, he cautions against the inherent risks and volatility associated with it. He also raises concerns about the potential risks associated with Bitcoin ETFs. While these funds might open the doors for institutional investors, they also expose them to the unpredictable movements of the crypto market. O'Leary argues that this volatility could lead to significant losses. 
especially for those who are new to the crypto space, or lack a deep understanding of its dynamics. Furthermore, O'Leary emphasizes the importance of regulatory clarity. He believes that for Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies to achieve mainstream acceptance and stability, there needs to be a comprehensive regulatory framework in place. This is a crucial aspect that, according to him, is often overlooked in the rush to capitalize on the latest trends. In the world of cryptocurrency, diverse opinions and perspectives are the norm rather than the exception. As we navigate through this exciting yet unpredictable journey, it's essential to keep an open mind and consider different viewpoints. After all, the world of finance is as much about understanding the diverse perspectives as it is about crunching numbers. In conclusion, Kathy Wood, the renowned investment guru, predicts a $1 million Bitcoin by 2030. Her anticipations are built on the transforming global monetary landscape, where traditional currencies are losing their value, rapidly becoming obsolete in the face of digital revolution. This shift is driven by the irreversible forces of technology and globalization, as people from all corners of the world are getting connected and becoming part of a global market, where Bitcoin and other cryptocurrencies are expected to play a central role. Furthermore, the approval of Bitcoin ETFs or exchange-traded funds marks a significant milestone in the mainstream acceptance of Bitcoin. ETFs are investment funds traded on stock exchanges much like individual stocks. This development opens up new avenues of investment drawing in institutional capital and high net worth individuals, thereby increasing the demand for Bitcoin. The potential influx of institutional capital is another factor contributing to Wood's audacious prediction. Institutional capital refers to the financial resources available to banks, financial institutions, hedge funds and other large entities. These institutions are starting to see the potential in Bitcoin, and their entry into the crypto space could have a profound impact. If her prediction comes to fruition, it will usher in a paradigm in the financial world, with Bitcoin taking center stage. This could herald a new era for Bitcoin indeed for the entire world of finance. Only time will reveal if this bold prediction becomes reality. For now, it certainly provides us an intriguing peek into a potentially revolutionary future.